Alrighty, so yeah, I'm having a lot of fun actually. Uh, there's some planes up above, nothing, nothing below, but and I'm just making up the rules as I go along, just and then you know uh, trying to figure out, it, uh, find problems right off the bat, kind of thing. Yeah, and there's nothing I can do with the lighting. Like you're just going to get at least not as bad as the sunlight in the last one. So right now it's going. It is um, the you know, the the green guys are the Austrians and these guys are the Italians. And there's two uh, Austrian planes just zipping around. And what I've done so far is I'm using, uh, I don't know no one's shot anybody yet. You can only shoot anybody, um, people straight uh, in front of you and they have to be uh, in the adjacent uh, square. Um, I'm only doing squares right now. Like I said, simple, simple. I just want to get one thing. The clutter will happen. Uh, and then I'm using these things here. So it's only one speed, two speed, three speed. Well, obviously you have to be going something speed. So I'm not putting any uh, speed counters below. I'm just using these things from a pirate thing too. Uh, so that's a two and a three. So when it's, uh, for example, it's about to be the Italian turn, you have to, uh, each plane has to go the speed of what they are. And then you get a free move kind of thing. And uh, if you go up um, um, up a level, it, uh, it, uh, you drop one movement point, so you can't, uh, if you only have one movement uh, uh, speed, if you want to call it that, you can't go up. Uh, but you can always go down, and uh, it's, so going up will uh, remove a speed, and going down will add one. So right now these guys are at two. The problem is, and then you get a free move, uh, so you can do like a turn, uh, accelerate, decelerate, uh, you know, drop, shoot, you get the idea. So anyways, so these guys, so it's now the um, uh, the Italian turn, they have to go to. Well, obviously I'm not going to send this guy, f uh, put him first, obviously, because they'd smash into each other. So I'm going to move this guy f first, and you're going to see, um, anyways, the free move is going to have to be a drop down because not um, a shoot because well actually they would ram into each other oh that would be horrible um, yeah I never thought of that but like I said I've got to learn these learn these rules so it's either so uh, this guy because he's a two he just finished doing his two in the next turn the Austrians are going to have to um, oh my gosh actually he can't accelerate the three um, no, that wouldn't be good actually. Unless I did, uh, unless I had it, you can also shoot and move, whatever. Because if he accelerate, if that, if the Italian person accelerated to three, they would move an extra square, and then I put a three there. But I think the best thing for that person right now is to use their free move um, to to drop or to go above, and they can go above. So I'm gonna I'm gonna do that. Um, I'll see what, uh, and they'll they'll lose a speed. And uh, I'll see if you can, I don't know if you can be able to see that. But there's two guys there. Oh, I'll try to pop them up. Anyway, so that's what I'll do. So that'll be his, so he's, he's moved the two. He's going to go back up to the 28 up. Imagine if I had nice pla uh, clear plastic. That would be so nice. So I'm going to get rid of this two. This is all brand new stuff. I'm just learning. I'm going to be a bazillion mistakes. Who cares? Um, it may not, and certainly not going to be a simulation. I can tell you that much for crying out loud. So there's his free move up there, as you can see. So they're all at one speed, just doing their thing. And then uh, I get down to here, and then this guy's going to go to, we'll have to go. Um, and I should have actually done the free uh, the moves first, but you get, well, you know what I mean. So, and obviously this guy's going to have to change direction, or, or uh, well, he actually has to change direction. If he, if he, if he went, he can go, no, if he went up. He's at the corner, so the next turn uh, he would have to go one space. He couldn't fall off the board, so he uh, he would die, and then um, can't. He has to, yeah. He has to change direction. There's an, uh, you, no choice, so that would be his free move, because uh, there's no other option. Uh, if he dropped down, he'll gain his speed. That'll drop him off the next turn. Goes up one, he's still screwed. It does nothing. He's, uh, he's screwed. So. And that would be it. And then for the next turn, as you can see, uh, just pretend we did did the up. But this guy is now uh, because of that one move over here. Oh my God! I didn't get to. Do, I finally finally get to do a combat. I haven't. And I know everybody and their dog always says D10 uh, is the best way to go. But I'll show you why I'm doing D6 yet again because of simplicity. We can deal with all the other stuff later. I don't even know what the combat's going to be like for Christ's sakes. 
So, uh, so well, well, excellent. So they move up two for sure and take a shot. And then I guess they're going to have to, um, uh, that, yeah, I'm obviously going to have to do it because otherwise they'd ram and destroy each other. So it's going to have to be, uh, yeah, it'll have to be a shot and then, it'll, and then you'll off you go, I think is what it's going to be. But here's the neato thing is look, um, I've, I love using these dice. And this is so coincidental that it's a brown and a, I don't know where they're from, but I love them. Uh, I think I probably got them from Can Games or something, but they have these um, nice little, like a fist or something with a sword or a dagger. Oops, sorry. And then, uh, yeah, I just love them. So those are the sixes instead of the, you don't get the six pips. So I thought, okay, let's go. Let's see what happens here. So let's say, uh, just just for the heck of it, uh, a one, uh, uh, a one's, uh, a one or a two's a miss. Uh, six is a destroy, and three, four, five, one hit, and then I put a little red token down. How's that? And we'll go from there. So I'm gonna roll a green die and see what happens. Because you're not gonna, well, I'll try. Who cares, eh? Oh my god, it's a direct hit! I mean, it's a direct kill. So, uh, that would be it. And then, kaboink, uh, off you go. You get the idea? And then I could still get the free move, I guess. So what would I do then? Um, I could drop down and accelerate or just do nothing. I think I'll just change direction. Um, yeah, let's change direction. Okay, I hope you get the idea. I think this is going to be fun, man. Okay, see you later.